It's Wednesday, June 28th. This is the Today in Kansas report. Senator Jerry Moran is no longer on the fence. I'm a possible yes vote and I'm a possible no vote. After yesterday's decision in the Senate to push back the health care reform bill, the junior senator from Kansas issued a statement saying the bill doesn't do enough for the people of the state and so he's going to vote no. Senator Pat Roberts had already indicated he'd vote for the bill but was not very happy about it. It's now confirmed the man accused of shooting at a KHP trooper in Sherman County last week is the same man suspected in more than a half dozen bank robberies in four states. Sherman County Sheriff Burton Pinalto. We were responding to accident from the shots fired because the trooper sent something was wrong. That man dubbed the AK-47 bandit was caught last week in Nebraska and is still being held there. A federal prosecutor in Kansas who said in court last year she never listened to attorney-client phone calls at the Leavenworth Detention Center has left the attorney's office after admitting to her supervisor that she actually did listen to the calls. Court documents show Aaron Tomasek told her supervisor she listened to the recorded phone conversations of two inmates and their attorneys. The state investigates allegations of physical abuse against toddlers at the South YMCA Early Learning Center in Wichita. This woman got a phone call from the state. My son and two other had possibly been abused and that the daycare facility was under investigation for possible physical abuse. A spokeswoman for the Y says they're cooperating with the state and doing an investigation of their own. The Kansas Commerce Secretary leaves for the private sector. The move comes just days before the governor's deputy chief of staff also leaves. She's taking a job with a conservative think tank. That also reignites rumors from the spring that the governor may be off to Rome to be the U.S. ambassador for three food and ag organizations. This is the Today in Kansas report. At Next Tech Wireless, something different just became something better. The wireless company that you can trust now offers unlimited data plans as low as $20 per line. Tethering is included, so you can power your other devices too, and there are no additional fees. Come to any Next Tech Wireless store for a free and honest consultation about your data and wireless needs. We have a plan that fits every budget and all the phones you want. Next Tech Wireless, say hello to something better. Whether you're in Wichita for one night or on a long-term stay, remember the Inn at Tallgrass, where you'll always feel right at home. The Inn at Tallgrass is located close to shopping, dining, entertainment, and most major businesses. Guests will find new bathrooms, beds, and flat-screen televisions, all of which make the accommodations comfortable and enjoyable for you. The Inn at Tallgrass provides free breakfast and internet, plus free full access to the Genesis Health Club and Tallgrass Country Club privileges. For information or booking, go to the theinnatallgrass.com. The Inn at Tallgrass in Wichita, you'll always feel right at home. 